The fifth question says, find the slope of a line which passes through the origin and the midpoint of the line segment joining the points this and this. Okay. Slope of a line. Slope of a line is being asked, which passes through the origin. Okay. Let's try to mark these points. The origin is 0, 0. This is what you can observe. Okay. And joining the midpoints of 0, minus 4. 0, minus 4 will be somewhere here. Okay, let's call this P. 0, minus 4. And B is 8, 0. Let's mark B over here. 8, 0. Okay. Slope of a line which passes through the origin and midpoint of the line segment. Midpoint. The midpoint is important, right? Midpoint of this line segment over here. Midpoint will be somewhere here. Let's call that midpoint Q. Okay. And the coordinates of Q can be found very easily. That will be x1 plus x2, 0 plus 8 by 2, x1 plus x2 by 2. Midpoint is x1 plus x2 by 2, y1 plus y2 by 2, minus 4 plus 0 by 2. And what does that give me? This is 8 by 2, which is 4, comma minus 4 by 2, which is minus 2. This is the midpoint, right? And next, we are asked to find the slope, slope of this particular line, joining this and this. Okay, so slope of any line is actually equal to y2 minus y1 upon x2 minus x1 for points, for let us say, lines for any line connecting x1, y1 and x2, passing through x1, y1 and x2, y2, right? If this is a line, then the slope is given by this formula. So, slope of O, Q, over there will be equal to what? For OQ, you will have Y2 minus Y1, which is minus 2 minus 0, and X2 minus X1, which is 4 minus 0. Oh, we could have taken X1, uh, sorry, X2, Y2 as this as well. So, in that case, you will have to do 0 minus or minus 2 and 0 minus 4. That will give you the same result, right? You don't have to worry about that. This is what you are getting, and what is that equal to? This is minus 2 upon 4 which is minus 1 by 2 and yes, that is the answer for this question over here. That is the final solution? Yes. So, you were asked the slope and you have found the slope in this manner.